The Watermark Arts Center in Bemidji is unveiling their new facility to the public tomorrow. For this week's In Focus, Lakeland News reporter Sherelle Moore has a preview of all the new exhibits the gallery has to offer. For almost 35 years, Watermark has brought beauty to the city of Bemidji with artwork created by local and regional artists. Tomorrow, they'll be starting a new chapter in their journey. A lot of people have given money and supported this project. Um, they've given their time. And so it's really exciting for everybody to kind of finally see this all come to fruition and be able to enjoy the new art center. This new space has been developing for a few years now. The old spot for the exhibit was getting a little cramped, so it was about time for an upgrade. We used to be in a space that was about one or two galleries with a small gift shop and some offices. Uh, in the Carnegie Library building and in about uh, 2012 we purchased this property to be able to grow into a bigger space. Several hundreds of art pieces line the walls of the Watermark Art Center each one special in its own way. Really unique about the new art center, uh, historically we had, as I mentioned, a couple, just a couple of galleries. The new facility actually has four galleries. We have the Lakeview Gallery, we have the Marley and Sandy Call Gallery, we have the Mikanon Gallery, which is dedicated to Native American art, and we have Bemidji State University has a, the Harlow Clevin Gallery. And so any time that you come, there's going to be anywhere from uh, th three to four shows that you can actually, or exhibits that you can actually see. So that's one thing that's exciting. And one of the cool things is that pieces actually rotate in and out, so you're bound to see something new every time you come. The shows that are here can stay up a little bit longer, uh, so people have time to access them and see the work. Some exhibits are up for two months, some of them are up maybe three or four months. So it's going to vary from show to show depending on what the work is. Somewhere down the line, Watermark hopes to become a regional venue for large art events, expanded gallery shows, and enhanced classroom experiences. Although right now, they're looking forward to the big day. It's uh, a lot of work by volunteers and the crew that built this. It's been exciting, but we're here today and we're excited to be able to open to the community on Saturday. Reporting in Bemidji with this week's In Focus, Sherelle Moore, Lakeland News. The grand opening starts tomorrow with a ribbon cutting ceremony at one in the afternoon. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.